35,000 high-priority Oregonians are set to get the, the Pfizer vaccine this week. And while that's only a drop in the bucket for those who need it, it puts us well on our way to the governor's goal of 100,000 Oregonians vaccinated by the end of the month. And we begin our team coverage tonight with Emma Jerome live at Peace Health Riverbend to tell us what the vice president of medicine says about the vaccine. Emma. Yeah, Matt Renee, Dr. James McGovern says they don't have their doses of the vaccine yet at their four Oregon hospitals, but he said as soon as they do, they are going into the arms of people who work in the COVID in emergency departments. Legacy Health Hospitals, two of them in Portland, were the first to receive the vaccine this morning. They each received 975 doses. Around 5,000 doses arrived at some Portland area hospitals or will arrive tomorrow. That leaves about 30,000 others that will arrive this week. Peace Health has four hospitals in Oregon, and they're only getting 975 doses this week for a nearly 6,000 doctors and physicians in their emergency and COVID departments. I think 2020 has been a historic, historical year, maybe historical, but historical year for many of us. Um, and this really is, I mean, having this vaccine come out as quickly as it has really is a historic moment. Um, it's not the end, but it is the beginning of the end. Mackenzie Willamette following suit will be receiving 975 of their own doses of the vaccine this week, and those as well will be going to COVID and emergency department doctors. McGovern said they are expecting more after this first batch, but he said the rollout, the way that it's happening, is testing the way that they're delivering these doses of the vaccine to different area hospitals. He said as soon as they get these vaccines, they're going into the arms of doctors. They are not holding any aside for the second dose, which we've all heard we need as well. Reporting live in Springfield, Emma Jerome, KEZI 9 News.